Hey, it's Chris from the Blockade Pinball Podcast once again with another Williams Pinball App Daily Challenge video, tutorial, strategy guide, tactics, I don't know what you want to call it. Anyway, today we're going to be playing Getaway in survival mode, uh, part of the advanced challenge, so second one from the top, and a total of 63 million needed to beat survival mode. I'm going to warn you guys, I'm, I, I enjoy Getaway. I'm terrible on mobile. Terrible! Um, I, I literally have can barely shoot the, the right orbit. The left orbit is just like a complete mystery to me. And shooting the, uh, the supercharger, which should be just incredibly easy. I don't know. I have just mental block for it. So we'll see how we do today. I don't know. Hopefully not too bad. Let's find out. I mean, literally, I don't have much of a strategy. I just have a way that I attack this table. <laughs> Launch. Shift. And uh, I don't want to be on the right flipper, but I will be. Okay. Man, I should have just let that get past. Right? So. Oh, you know, with my finger and shift gears. Okay. Um, so, there's not a lot of points on this table unless you're shooting the orbits. And so you gotta keep your eye on the the meter there in survival mode to make sure that you're not just in no man's land, which I'm currently in. Um oh, okay, so there, boom. That knocked off one star. <laughs> okay, video mode. There. So I wanna get into fourth, fifth year as fast as I can, because um, that's when I can start racking up some major points. Um, getting multi-ball, I'm not really concerned, because I honestly don't know how to actually light the locks. Not with any kind of consistency. It just kind of happens for me. Kind of like that one did. I wasn't even aware the lock was lit. Bounce. No. Oh, oh man. I thought I was in one ball. So I'm having flashbacks. I was trying to do the one ball challenge, and I spent an entire day trying to do the one ball challenge, and I didn't get it. <laughs> so I reset it, and I got this instead. Oh, here we go. So Supercharged lived 5 million for all these shots. Just rack some points. I could actually end this game right now if I racked up enough of these. I haven't even shot the supercharger yet. Why? Because I'm not good at it. I'll tell you though, nail on that left orbit. Boom, done. Let's see what the magic coin count says. Come on, big coins, big coins, big coins. Nope. Oh boy. A flipper with flames. Isn't that exciting? Um, so, well, yeah, that, was, that was that was shorter than I'm used to. Um, but that's survival. It, it's... You gotta remember, when you start with survival challenges, A, they actually are easier in hard than they are in easy, because in easy, you have more points to fill per star bar than you do when you're in hard. The star bar gets less, but of course you have more bars to fill. When you are first starting the game, not as many points are required to fill the bar. So on a lot of games when I'm playing survival mode, it's setting myself up because I can take the time. I can, I can prime all the lanes, get everything lit and ready for the big points so that I'm still filling the bar up because it's relatively easy, but the point total isn't so gigantic yet that it becomes impossible. With Getaway, you're not really lighting lanes so much as you're shifting through your gears. You've got to get to fourth gear as fast as you can, um, because that's when you're going to start lighting video mode. You're going to start lighting a supercharger bonus of 5 million per shot. Um, you're going to just, by nature of doing that, get your multiball going. Uh, if you can get all the way through fifth, then you get Redline Mania going. All your points 
are at the back half of things, but you got to keep your eye on that on that survival ticker because otherwise there's no points on the table. If you're not hitting those loops and you're just hitting pop bumpers and I don't even know what the heck the the lower play field is for. I just like I guess if I had all the time in the world, I could kind of maybe shoot for things, but I hate getting side to side on this table because side to side is an outlane nightmare. So that's kind of why it's for me. It's just about racking up the and 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 racking up the orbits, and specifically because I can hit it a lot more consistently. I shoot that right orbit, catch it with the left flipper. Interestingly enough, if you shoot the left orbit and try and catch it with the right flipper. Oh, by 50-50 as to whether it stays on that flipper or bounces up and possibly center drain. So there you go. Um, I will keep on trying to do the one ball challenge on Getaway. It, it was so frustrating. I think I had to get 144 million on one ball and I closest I got was like 110, 120. Um, yeah, it, it was. I seriously was like ready to throw the phone. It was not good. At least I enjoy playing the table. It wasn't Champion Pub or Safe Cracker. So, um, all right. That is all we have for this particular video. Again, thank you for watching. Subscribe to the Blockade Pinball Podcast channel on YouTube. And make sure, hey, look, we have we have the Twitter information. Make sure you follow us, and then you'll get notifications that uh, these kind of videos are dropping. So, thanks again for watching. Bye-bye. <laughs>